Hey guys, welcome to another ARC video mutations for dummies. And in this one, um, I want to teach you guys um, kind of the same concept with colors as you would do for stats. So a lot of people, um, in, especially in PvE, don't really care about um, mute or, or breeding for, for stats. Um, they, they prefer to go for colors. There are other people who try to go for colors and stats. Um, in this video, by popular request, I'm going to show you guys how to get the colors you want on the dinos you want um, as you are essentially breeding. So we're going to do that in this video. So anyway, basically what you do, um, since you're going for colors, um, it doesn't really matter what dinos you do. Um, but for me, I just use my regular line of perfect Rexes. These are all perfect. Um, they have high melee and high health. This one has the perfect ones have 43 in melee, 51 in health. And then I just breed them um, for regular stat mutations. As I'm doing that, I am collecting dinos, right? So basically what I'm doing is I am looking through the dinos as I get them, or the babies as I get them. We'll try that again, all right? So essentially, as I get the dinos, Right, so here's some, uh, let's see. I guess I don't have any Rexes in here right now. But let's just say that I'm looking for um, 222 as a, as a, as a um, color ID. And you can see in the zero region on this Megatherium, I have 222. So basically, I would just keep breeding until I get the color that I want in the... Um, in the region that I wanted. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to get, essentially for me, I'm looking for only 79, which is the color region called actual black. Now, I have been mating these 10 females with a male Rex for, I think it's 56 mutations now. So it's been about a month of just solid breeding those guys. So here is my current breeder that is growing up i just got so he's got 54 mutations 24 in health 30 in melee okay and obviously he looks massively different than the perfect ones that i have inside that i started with but over the time of me breeding all of these i have been looking for the 79 region the actual black now all of these dinos right here have come from those females in there and every single one of them has the actual black 79 in them in a different region, as you can see. All right, so this one has it in region 0. This one has it in region 1. This one has it in region 2. This one's in region 3. This one is in region 4. And this one is in region 5. All right? So basically what we're going to do, since now we have... All six regions with the colors that we want, right? And again, this has taken over a month of breeding. This is not a, 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 a fast process, okay? And you just kind of have to sift through your dinos. Eventually, you will get the colors you want. You just have to pay attention. So basically, what I want to do is I want to turn these six babies into one creature, preferably two, a male and a female, that is completely actual black just completely 79 so i'm going to grow these up and then i'll show you the next step all right so now we have our six rexes all grown up and i have two males and four females and i have broken off one male with these two females here and then i have broken off the other male with the other two females over here so now what we're trying to do <coughs> is we're just trying to get multiple 79s on, on, an, on a baby, right? So, obviously, if you want different colors, then you would combine them a different way. But for me, since I'm doing them all on the same color, I'm just looking for multiple blacks on the same eggs. Okay? And thankfully, with the incubator, we can see that. We have no 79s there. We have one 79 there. None there none there right so we have one there and one there okay but what i'm looking for are two so i'm going to keep going until we 
um, until we get a, until we get two. All right, so we're just gonna crack all of these eggs. It'd be cool if I could just crack them all at once. Yes, we can't though, huh? So we're just gonna go ahead and do that, and I'll be right back when we have two seventy uh, nines. All right, so we have an egg with regions two and region five um, with the 79. So that's a start. So now what you want to do now, and since this is a male baby, right? So this is a male. Okay, so the male, um, I have it written down. I have the male right here has the region five right here, right? So basically this one and this one, these two here just gave me um, the baby with the with the with the five and the two. So this one and this one can go away. We don't need them anymore. So that um, that two slash five, uh, the region two and region five um, on the male replaces both of them. And then I will uh, once that's grown up, um, I will be right back. All right, guys, so we're back, and we actually have um, two different males now, both with two regions of 79. So we have region 1 and 4 on this Rex right here. So I have paired that one now with the female that has region 3, okay? And then this male over here has regions two and five as black and i've paired him with female that has the zero region as black so now what i'm going to do is i will breed these ones together these two and these two until i have um babies with three regions with 60 uh, with 79 on it All right, so we're back, and we have a male and a female, each with three um, regions of 79, and they're the opposite of each other. So you can see my male has zero, two, and five regions as actual black, and the female has one, three, and four as actual black. So this will be the first egg we're taking from them. Now, we're halfway through this, um, process of trying to make um, all six regions basically what I want, okay? So basically from this point forward, I am keeping any male dino that has four or more four or more of the color regions that I want, four or more, okay? And I'm keeping any female that has the has three or more, okay? So it, it essentially has to have three or more here four or more here um and that's how we will eventually get six okay because basically i have one female so if i if i get any more females that have three color regions is 79 then i can add them to this um breeding um to the male and it doubles my chances essentially so we've gotten through the easy part the hard part is getting uh, fourth, fifth, and sixth color regions to, to match up. That's when you really need more than one female. So um, this process will probably take me a little bit longer, but I'll see you um, when we uh, get uh, probably... Uh, I'll see you when we get five out of six on both sides here, okay? Okay, guys, so I literally, literally just ended the recording for that last part. And this is the first egg that we got from the three out of six, three out of six. And look what has just happened. We got six out of six literally in the first egg, okay? Literally in the first egg. This is insane. Um, so, wow, this is actually crazy. So we have our first actual black Tyrannosaur, Paleo Tyrannosaur, on the first egg um, uh, at the halfway point. Um, I'm actually like blown away, that's why I started the recording again. This is actually crazy. First egg, 
we have a three out of six on the on the on the female side and a three out of six on the male side and all of them lined up on the very first egg that is absolutely crazy um so basically what we're going to do now is we're going to take this baby which is a male it's going to replace our three out of six male over there and then he will um he will mate with the female over there until we uh, i mean ultimately until we get a female um with the, with the six out of six as well once we have a, a male and a female of the six out of six um i will be back when that happens okay 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 um super lucky once again um how do i get rid of this is it backspace it is okay super lucky our first egg from our three out of six male and our three out of six female gave us twins um both obviously are fully actual black um let me show you. All six regions, 79s. It also has the 103 melee from my um, from my line. It doesn't have the health, but um, it has the melee. Um, so basically, all I would do is mate these two together um, to get. Um, more more black dinos essentially and then what I'll do is I will try to get the health from my boss line onto these creatures as well and then my boss line will be completely um, actual black but yeah that's how you do it guys you just have to be patient you're probably gonna have to breed a lot more than I did I did get super lucky um, really really lucky actually Sometimes that happens. More times than not, you're not going to get this lucky. Um, but I hope you guys enjoy this. If you have any questions about uh, anything, really, about breeding for colors or for stats or anything, let me know in the comments down below. Um, really super excited to get um, six out of six on my first egg from the three out of six couple. And then have that egg have uh, be twins. It, it's insane. Insane luck. My first all actual black Rexes. Paleo Rexes, too. And, uh, yeah, so thanks for tuning in, guys. Um, if you like this video, show it some love. Took a lot of time and effort to put this together. Um, and, uh, of course, if you want to see more like this one, you can, of course, subscribe. And I'll catch you down the road.